How's it going guys? It's Mighty Mac here. Welcome back to the channel now. Before this video starts, if you guys can please smash that like button and subscribe. That is very much appreciated. Anyways guys, this video is all about the legend clothing and like the character skins that you can unlock and basically all the collectibles as well and basically how you can get them because it's not very specific how you can actually get either one of these in the game. So as you know, from the release date of this game, there wasn't all these kind of character skins at the start. But anyways guys, I'm going to basically talk about how you can get the legend skins for all the characters. So as you can see it says complete Marianne's legend and when you think about it like what the hell is that? Now I'm going to tell you guys when you come over to the trinkets and collectibles and all that stuff which is over here under collectibles. And then we're under trinkets right now, which is all about the maps. Then if you click R2 or whatever it is for you on PC or Xbox, you go on legends. So it shows you all the characters here because there's a legend costume and skin for absolutely every single one. So my main is obviously this chick, Marianne or Marianne, however you basically name her or say her name. But as you can see, it's just all this junk about the writing and stuff and then it says legend locked win one more match as Marianne to unlock this legend piece so basically in total you need 35 matches won as that character in order to unlock their legend skin now I thought it was pretty like not easy to find out about this but as well about that it's not just Marianne it is basically every single character such as John like you need 35 matches to get the skin as well as Robin as well to get that dope skeleton head looking skin I mean that's gonna be pretty sick but yeah so on so forth and then next up uh, basically we can see all their skins so let's just go all the way down to the bottom so that's the John's legend which actually looks pretty nice pretty nice I like the helmet and then Took is weird, like my man is blindfolded, don't know, I understand that. And then like this guy, Robin's one is absolutely sick, like we've already seen the photo of him, it's absolutely, yeah, insane. And then honestly, Marianne's legend I think could be a little bit better, like I understand the gold cape as such, but like it's so worn down, like make it shiny or some shit. I understand we're supposed to be like hidden, but like, you know make it make it a bit more appealing and now guys I'm gonna talk about basically the trinkets how on earth do you get all these trinkets so like for me on Lionsdale I've already collected them all same as Newtown uh, Abbas and then I got four out of six on Kim I can't even pronounce his names it's not I'm sorry <laughs> and then I got six out of six on New Barnsdale Outpost which like yeah, pretty good, pretty good. And then the last one, I've only got one out of six on Gideon's Rest. Now, how you unlock these trinkets is actually by assassinating. You have to assassinate the uh, enemy, like, PC, no, the PvE, the, like, the bots. You have to assassinate the bots in the game in order to actually unlock the new trinkets. And it's random, it's just, like, out of luck, out of the spawn of what you're going to get. But that is actually how you get these trinkets. You don't go around the map literally searching for these little artifacts. No, that's not what you do, because that's what I originally thought. No, you actually have to assassinate the, um, the bots in the game. And that's pretty easy to do, and I think, I think it will even say at the end of the match, or even when you get it, it says, oh, new trinket unlocked. Like, that's how you will know. So guys, this video was actually pretty quick, but I just want to let you guys know because honestly, some things in this game aren't the easiest things to find out, but I hope I hope I made this really easy for you guys to understand. If you did and want to see more Horde Outlaws and Legends videos from me, make sure to smash that like button and subscribe. And honestly, I'll see you guys in my live streams or the next video, so have a good one and goodbye.